Ellie De La Cruz can bring you back a top 25 player. I think you should listen. It's fun to roster him. You want to have it. But when people are offering you Corey Seager, you get maybe one of the best pitchers in baseball and Spencer Strider, Shane McClanahan. He's sitting in a range where even us are considering, maybe I don't trade Manny Machado to do that, but people are selling out hard and I'm listening. I'm not trying to actively trade him because I do think there's some rest of season projections that are still really in his favor. 16 homers, I think in the 20 stolen bases for the rest of the year. Those are awesome stats. He easily could become a top four round fantasy player even with some of those warts. But if someone's offering you Juan Soto, I'm listening. And that's what I think the advice really should be, is listen for the big offers on L.A. De La Cruz, but don't just trade him to trade him because some of the few advanced stats don't work in his favor.